There's an outfit here in Atlanta called Southeast Transportation. And I called them to see if I could get transportation to go and get my vaccine shot. And they told me since I wasn't going to see my doctor, I couldn't get transportation to them. They say Medicare won't pay for it. Or Medicaid won't. Well, I'm quite sure they transport people to dialysis clinics and that is not going to see a doctor. That's a medical procedure. And going and getting a vaccine shot is also a medical procedure. If I had to get x-rays and couldn't do it the same day that I went to see my doctor, and I would have to come back. Apparently, they're saying they won't transport me to get x-rays done or to get lab work done because I'm not seeing my doctor. Personally, I think Southeast Transportation needs to put a check on themselves because if they transport people for dialysis, that's a medical procedure, You're not going to visit a doctor. It's not a regular doctor's appointment. It's a medical procedure. Ah, uh, yes, ma'am. I'd like to speak with your supervisor, please. Southeast Transportation basically just hung up on me. Four people for dialysis clinic. Well, see, I, if I, I'm pretty sure that you do, okay, and. I'm told that since I'm not going to see a doctor, y'all won't transport me to get a vaccine shot. It's a medical procedure. And I'm quite sure that you transport people for a dialysis clinic, don't you? Yeah, I'm aware of the Uh, I mean, like, if if I was, if my doctor wanted x-rays done and I couldn't get it the same day I'm at my doctor's house apartment, and they scheduled it for another day, you would have to transport me, correct? I'm not sure, sir. I don't handle transportation. I'm just the front desk. Oh, well, I just, oh, I want to uh, let you know that I'm talking to you right now, and I'm videoing myself talking to you. And this is going to be on the internet. Okay? You know, okay. if y'all won't transport somebody for a medical procedure, y'all got problems. Okay? And I intend to file some complaints about that. I mean, you have people here the the when it comes to vaccine, there's so many senior citizens that are left to get the appointments by themselves. You know, 
half of them, most of them don't have access to computers and are com computer illiterate. You know, and then we're left to uh, do it ourselves. And what's fair about that? And what's fair about not being able to go and get the vaccine? Well, I'd like to speak with your supervisor. <laughs>